Morning everybody, John and my woodsman. Yeah, about 4.30 in the morning, no sleep. Figured it was a good time to do this pay it forward support video for Full Circle Outdoors 414. Jen has a great channel. Um, congrats on the subs. She's having her 100 sub giveaway. I looked a little while ago, she was at 141, so she's growing fast. She's got some great stuff. She's very crafty, bushcraft. Um, she wanted us to do something on the five C's. Five C's is all good. I'm kind of old school. I like to think of it as the five or ten essentials. From back in the 70s with Gene Ward. But this is what I carry. This is the first thing that I don't go out in the woods with. And that's my canteen. It comes with my cup, my stove. That's all one for me because it's kind of a package deal if I'm going to carry my water. This is kind of the deal. Got this from uh, Robert Bluegrass Bushcraft and bought, bought a Nalgene bottle for it. Um, I like to see in my bottles and see what's in there. <laughs> anyway, that's the first thing. Uh, the second thing is my shelter. This little cheap 5x7 Wally World tarp works great. I use it for a ground cloth all the time when I'm ground dwelling. Put it underneath my sleeping pad. It's got like a vinyl feeling on one side almost and uh, man my my sleeping pad sticks right to it and doesn't move around at night it's really nice and it's great for cover get you out of the, the climate weather make a shelter for the night five by seven a little small but if you put it up right you can get yourself covered and stay warm get a good fire going Next thing is my headlamp. Got to have a light out in the woods. At least one. I always carry at least two. Um, I carry this one. I always have my EDC light. Always. No matter what. So, a little redundancy here and there, but this is my minimum essentials for going out in the woods. There's my light. Next is my uh, my Baco backlander, a Laplander fits in good. Got a little jute twine, some fat wood on there. Nice, nice bit, of, nice bit of kit. Good addition. I could always start fire with just this and my ferro rod. First, the number one thing I got, Jen, is my knife. Um, it's nothing super fancy. It's been a great knife. Condor bush lore, it's razor sharp, holds a nice edge, nice quality knife. I got my Mr. Scooty 1968 fire steel for my uh, combustion device. So these are my five C's that I usually take. I always take, I should say, I never leave home without them in one shape form. Um, but. There you go, Jen. That's that's my uh, all my essentials. Hope this works for your giveaway. I know you got some great prizes, some handcrafted items. I'd like you to pay it forward, though, if I win. Um, take another lucky draw out of the hat and pick another pick another person and, and send it to them. Um, just my way of saying thanks to everybody. Um, again, I lost uh, 97 friends, so I'm trying to find you all again and subscribe back to you. So if you see that I've unsubbed you, PM me, send me a message, anything, say, hey, where'd you go? And I'll be more than happy to resub you. Just uh, Google's been playing their games some more. Then I got a couple shout outs, of course. My first shout out, he's got nine vids and 56 subs. Great channel. I'd like to see him hit 100. Um, John1416 Bushcraft. He's a Christian Bushcrafter. You gotta go check him out. I can't, I can't give everything up. Uh, go check his channel out. He's just starting. He's doing a great job. Got some great content. My other shout out goes to the Outside Guys Bushcraft. Great bushcraft channel. Great reviews, tips. They got uh, a lot of vids. 103 subs. 
go check them guys out too if you would please give them all a sub a like and a share tell them i sent you so make sure you go see uh jen over there at uh, full circle outdoors 414 get in on that giveaway show her your support and check out my shout outs i'll put links below for everybody Alrighty, with that everybody, have a good morning and a great day. God bless.